welcome. Hi, hello, hello and a happy new year happy to new everybody. Year. I hope you all had a fantastic Christmas. Um, Christmas break, Christmas day, everything. Um, and Santa bought you what you wanted and you had a lovely time with your loved ones. Um, ours has been good, uh, apart from me getting sick mm. on Christmas day and only just getting better <laughs> today, New Year's yeah. day. Um, but that's good. I don't want to start 2017 being sick really. Mm. So. They give you a chance to catch up on the vlogs. Yes, I've been having fun catching up on a lot of vlogs. Um, still got loads more to catch up on. Um, but yeah, you've been keeping me company and distracted. So thank you very much everybody. Um, but yeah, we just wanted to say a quick Happy New Year to everybody. And we hope that 2017 brings you much joy, happiness, health and everything you ever wanted. Um, and we're very grateful to everyone that has tuned into our channel, yes. watched our videos, um, interacted with us on Twitter. We love our Twitter family, our Twitter friends, Disney friends, um, and we hope to uh, make many, many more and hopefully maybe meet some of you guys as yeah, well. Yes. Yeah. So, yeah, so um, happy new year yeah. from us. Thank you <laughs> and then what we also thought we would do is show you what we got for Christmas. Um, I personally like these kind of videos. I know some people, it's a bit kind of, you know, hit or miss with some because they think you're bragging, but we are in no way no. bragging. We just thought we'd share what we got because we've got a lot of Disney stuff. Um, and I'm so happy and grateful and I was very spoiled this year. Yeah, we, we, don't, we don't do a huge amount with throughout the year, you know, because, you know, everyone's got money wise, don't they? Um, so we sort of try and save up for Christmas and Go, go a bit all out, but we're yeah. the so. Yes, um, it's the one time of year I actually do go pretty nuts <laughs> yeah. on a holiday. <laughs> I yeah. get so excited, I don't know why. I mean, it's it's not it's not just about the presents for us, it's about the break as well, mm, and spending break, time yeah. with, with family and gorging. Mm. <laughs> um, but yeah, it's... Yeah, because my mum used to go nuts at Christmas, we really, <clears throat> whenever you used to get anything throughout the year. Um, you could get maybe something on your birthday, and then Christmas you it would just be like balls to the wall, presents and drink and food and snacks. And Whereas I was the total stuff. opposite. Um, <clears throat> I'm not an only child. I do have an older brother, but he's like 11 years older than me. So mostly what I've grown up with is my parents, just the three of us, and it would be a very quiet Christmas because I think as I got older, it got less fun maybe because mm. we're not buying toys and stuff um, so we would always have a really quiet Christmas and then when David moved in with us we he kind of bought well, what Christmas his cheer. yeah he <laughs> bought his Christmas to our house and um, yeah ever since then it's kind of been just nice. gone crazy <laughs> and it's been really fun yeah so um, but yes that's let's show you what we got we'll start with the Disney stuff first um, and then once that's done, you can tell if you want. <laughs> um, but who goes first? Ladies first, as always. Okay. I'm nothing if not a gentleman. What to choose from? What to choose from? Okay, well these are sort of Christmas presents because I got them before Christmas, but I I didn't pay for them, so. No, you're right, you're wrong, gone I, for you. you. Yeah, yeah. So I class them as gifts because they are. <laughs> well, they are. They so are. the first one was this jumper. I can't mm. see myself. Yeah, no, it's all <laughs> sparkly and it is, yeah, you know, it's, rhinestones it's, kind of, Yeah, it's kinda of like sequiny rhinestones yeah. they are. Just try not to dip this into my tea, but whoop, there we go. Yeah, <laughs> 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 yeah so it's like going. a rhinestone Mickey. So cool, nice sweatshirt. Can't wait to wear this. And this was from my aunt and this is from Primark. Um and I can tell you the price if you're interested. It's twelve pounds. <laughs> And I love it. And then um, I also got this one, which I've already worn. Oh Momentary pause. Our cat's going a little train. And we're back. Take two. Oh, <laughs> um, so we're carrying theme. This whole take one, take two I thing, know, but isn't it's it? Bloody cats and nuisance. Yes, she just decided that she wanted to be part of this video mm. and, and tell you that she's doing a weebie. Mm. So anyway, <laughs> yeah. this is the second jumper I got, which I love. It's so, so soft and snuggly warm. It's like kind of fleecy inside. Really um, but yes, 
that is my jumping a bit too. Christmasy and I wore it on Christmas Day and then I've kind of been living in it since so I kind of need to chuck it in the wash. Um, and then the last jumper I got which I've been after for ages but I've been a bit cheap because I just figured you know it was too expensive for what it was. I got this from Sports Direct. I don't know if you can see it yeah. but it's mini and it's got sort of sequiny hat little bubble sticking out and then her cute little cheeky pose um yeah i haven't worn this yet but it will get worn <laughs> yes. i like me really that um you can go next because i kind of took over and just did everything no 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 you go oh my <coughs> uh <coughs> Which isn't really much i haven't got anything no, in well you've got that and then the one down there Oh, no, then, okay, yeah, yeah. Fine. Um, I I've got, obviously, now I met a, a certain character. Um, during the holiday, and Steph got me this little Robin Hood pop vinyl, which we haven't got a huge amount of these, but I love him. He's, he's so cool, and yeah, I said the best. other two in this set are pretty awesome. Yeah, as well, um, aren't they? Hiss and Prince John. John. Yeah. yeah, and uh, yeah, this is awesome. My favourite interaction from this year was with this little guy. Yeah, um, I thought I had to get yeah. you something. Um, Robin Hood related. He's so cool, he's got a little bow and everything. Yeah. So cool. So cool. <laughs> Me? Or you? No, 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 keep going. Okay. Uh, those are in red. These are. Don't, yeah. Um, I like really loud pajama bombs or pants or lounge pants, as you call them. So Steph has got me two pairs. One's Disney, one's not. But that's fine, we can forgive her. <laughs> Wait, what? <laughs> the other ones aren't Disney. Oh yeah. <laughs> okay. my, these are like I guess the Avengers. So you've got yeah. sort of Thor, Hulk, Captain America, Spidey. And um Yeah, I think they're awesome. They're really cool. Hulk, Captain America, Thor, Spider Man, Iron Man. Maybe Iron Man, yeah. It's just all the boys, no girls on there. Maybe one from the Oh yeah. It's fine, don't know. And one day maybe. And the yeah. Archer as well. So, it's Hawkeye on there. Hawkeye, no, no Hawkeye. I was going to say, is there Hawkeye? No Hawkeye. <laughs> <laughs> yes, I love my, my really loud. I get quite a few funny looks on the takeaway delivery people. <laughs> <laughs> I think one outright laughed at you, didn't they? Yeah, he, he <laughs> so laughed. I, was, I thought you cheeky, so. Laughing at. <laughs> this one? Do you have pants? Oh, my other pants. Yeah. Um, I think my other pants are. My favourite superhero, which is Superman. Yeah. Love Superman. Because <laughs> you've got Batman. You've got a pair of Batman ones, yep. Yeah. yeah, you've got your minion ones, Maybe. which you've seen when he my, was being eaten by a tree. And my Muppets. Yes. Which I'll probably have to get rid of because they're a bit old. Yeah, now. Oh. I'm getting on a bit. Yeah. See? And then that one. This? Yeah. Um, okay, surprise present. I was actually expecting this. Um, <laughs> Hopefully I'll get to use it sometime in the future. Hopefully soon in the future. Yeah. And sooner rather than later. But um it should serve me quite well. So yeah. Yes, I I had to get I don't know why, I just he was saying he liked the look of it and we don't normally go for the band stuff because it's a bit loud for us. I mean we're a little bit boring when we it comes to clothes. Well, you can only wear it in Disney really yeah. like people in my family and my work I never understand if I was to wear. Yeah. Yeah. Alien vans to work or something. Yeah. Um, but yeah. David absolutely loves the aliens. So. Yeah, I love them. They're so cool. The un, un, unsung heroes of the film? Yes, yeah. yeah. They <laughs> saved the day. They were going to, you know, spoilers. Spoiler stuff, alert. But, yeah. <laughs> so, yes, I love my backpack and hopefully, even you know, soon, I'll be able to use it. Uh, I'll probably use it when we go and see uh, Mitch and Lynn on Paul and Christmas. Yes. Oh, yep, you overnight bag. Yeah. Uh, I need an overnight bag now. Sure, Now we're doing Right. Your <clears throat> okay, so next Disney Christmas mask present is I got Finding Dory and Zootropolis, which I was very, very happy with because I don't know why, but I really, really loved Finding Dory. Um, it was just so cute and all the new characters as well and baby Dory is just so adorable and yes, I love her. Um, so I watched that pretty much straight away. Yeah, um, when boxing? Probably boxing yeah, day. Boxing yeah, boxing day. I literally woke up, 
Oh, now she's making tea. Now I went Dory. You went Dory. I was like, wow, well, okay. Oh, crack on. <laughs> Um, and then Zootropolis, I absolutely loved. I think this is way better than Inside Out. Oh yeah, um, Inside Out was a bit. When I yeah. first watched this, I was just laughing non-stop. And I mean, Flash, the sloth, love him. Oh, it was funny being so irritating. I was like, I mean, I... <laughs> and then he had to tell the joke to the other girl, and it was <laughs> yeah. just like, ah! <laughs> but yeah, if you haven't seen these yeah. films, you definitely need to watch them. They're really, really good. Um, and then a, oh, ooh, ooh, ah, ooh. <laughs> a surprise present, which um, very random. Yeah, very random, but very cool as well. Stitchy, it's a little Sum Sum Stitch, but he's not just a Sum Sum. No, he has a special hidden feature, which is gonna be annoying to get back in. <laughs> but. Uh. Here's a carrier bag or a tote shopping, bag, shopping bag, reusable shopping bag. When I first saw it, I thought it went on the uh, on the suitcase because the picture. <laughs> no, but then basically you hold him, so you put him on your shoulder when you're walking around. So he sort of sits there and well, goes on. You go. Yeah, so just go I got a stitch on my shoulder. Like like Pascal for. <laughs> yeah. They do other um, ones as well, I'm assuming. Yeah. So, but yeah, and it's got um, it's got all the Tsum Tsum characters on there, not just Stitch, so you've got Minnie and Donald and Jeff and Leo. Yeah, so that is cute. And uh, yeah, I will put that away later. <laughs> um, <clears throat> and then I think I'll carry on because there's no more Disney for you. Really, is there? Yeah, you, you go for it. Yeah. <laughs> carry on with the Disney and then you can do yours after that. So then the next present I got, um, was I love this it's a Pandora charm and uh, I don't think you can see it I need to cover my face and your face but it's Rapunzel's dress um you can kind of get the gist of it I'll try and do a close up maybe um but yeah it's Rapunzel's dress because I have Belle which my parents got me for my 30th um and yeah I just I'm very happy with this Rapunzel is my second favourite princess next to Belle. You've got another one though, so you didn't like it anymore. No. It's not much in the one? No. Hmm, I thought I got you another one. Oh wait, did they buy me two? No, they only bought me one. Hmm. They wanted to buy me two, but I said, no, I just want Belle. <laughs> so, yes. But I wouldn't mind making a princess bracelet, actually. I kind of like the idea of the pink leather Pandora and then just putting the princess in there. So yeah, that's that. And then... The next one is Disney Couture. Do love Disney Couture, they do some really good jewellery. And David got me is again I'll see if I can do. But it's Olaf. It's an Olaf necklace with his little carrot nose. And then what I didn't notice before was here. This bit here, that's all diamonds, well, diamante, and then you've got pearls as well, which is pretty cool. I've never noticed that before. Um, but it's really cool. Like I say, I love Disney Couture, and um, I've got a flounder necklace, which is really yeah. cool. You've done quite well with Disney Couture presents. Well, if you wait till Christmas, there's always <coughs> items on sale. Oh, yeah. So. Yeah. <laughs> and then I got another <coughs> Disney Couture. Very, very spoiled. Um, oh yeah. Last Disney present is, and David gets this for me every year, it's the Kincaid, Thomas Kincaid calendar, um, which I absolutely love getting and I, the, I mean they repeat the photos a lot but that's fine because you know it's still pretty to look at but so January is Tangled, which I was very pleased to see because this is kind of my favourite scene. Um, and then show you the next mm -hmm. best month, which is July. That's my birthday. Available. Um, and I got I got Lady yeah. in the yeah. Trap for my um, for my birthday month. And David has. I actually saw. Gemma from Spoonful of Sugar wearing her Mickey ears 
uh, earrings, and I was like, mm, it does look really cool, and it's like a subtle Disney to uh, wear. Yes, that's why you mentioned it. <laughs> um, but again, I don't know if you can see that. I'll try and do close ups, but yeah, it's just Diamante Mickey we'll put, head. We'll put a picture I in. Absolutely it. love them. Thank you. <laughs> um, and that. You got one more Disney card. One more. Can I have you? No. Yes. Oh yeah, sorry as I thought that one. <laughs> so. no, yeah. So last Disney one, you've probably seen this on Instagram and Twitter. This was very unexpected, but David got me the Disney Holiday Disney Parks Holiday Collection mm -hmm. teapot. Um and it's so cute. It's got Mickey and Minnie and it's got the characters from Snow White, like the animals. So Is it Snow White or Sleeping Beauty? Oh, sorry, not Snow White, Sleeping Beauty. Hey. Yeah, excuse me. Um, ooh, yeah, I've got to be really careful here. <laughs> but yeah, it's really cool and it's got a little star on top and I haven't used it. I was debating whether to put hot chocolate in it, but it would have needed a lot of milk mm. <laughs> because it's quite, if, well, quite deep. So, would, if, anyone else, if anyone else had this, would you keep it as a collectible or would you actually use it? Yes. Yeah, we were thinking, should we use it mm. or should we keep it as collectible? But then, is it going to be one of those things you only get out sits, of Christmas? Yeah, it just sits there on the side. You know, you which kind of makes it? me feel bad. Mm. You know, but I don't know. What do you think? What if if anyone got one of these for Christmas or something similar, like Disney teapotty wise? Um, what are you doing with it? <laughs> um, but yeah, David's birthday month is October, and oh, he gets getting the beanies. I think last month she had Lion King as well, didn't I? Yeah, you had Lion King. Mm. And then December is... Which is pretty awesome, actually. Big cheese. Mm -hmm. yes. So, very happy with that. Yeah. And that is going up today. Because I did, haven't flicked through it. I hadn't even opened it when I first got it. Because I was like, nope. Got to open it on the 1st of January. Um, but the updates on this are Clock Strikes Midnight, which is the new Cinderella movie. There's Pirates of the Caribbean, Tangled, and Winnie the Pooh. Yes, so that's all the Disney stuff that um, I got and we got, uh, or David got. <laughs> um, <coughs> so now it's all non-Disney, but still very much fun. Um, so I'll hand it to you now. And you can finish off now. What should I do? <laughs> Any more than one thing? <coughs> awesome superhero movie. Um, we saw this in the cinema uh, when it first came out, and I yeah, laughed my I arse off from start to finish. And it was really yeah. surprising. No one else in the cinema was laughing, but they were just so immature and toilet sort of humour in a way that, which is just totally my speed. <laughs> so, yeah, um, well, I mean. It's just rude, isn't it? It's yeah. Like so references. Uh, it so. was. It was weird that it wasn't getting as many laughs in the cinema mm. as we thought it would. I mean, just little things like even in the opening, and has like you know the Green Lantern card, for example. Oh uh, yeah. Like, it's just like, it's just taking the Mickey out of himself, which is good. Um, so I got that, which we watched already. Yep. Uh, and then I got this, which obviously is hit and miss with some people. Um, I like it. I liked it. You know, it's fun. You know, you just yeah. take it as a it's a sort of summer kind of. Don't need to think along with it kind of movie. Yeah, and this was the extended cut, yeah. which had a few more scenes of the Joker. Yeah, it had a few more scenes, but it wasn't really movie changing. Mm. Like there were some scenes where I think Harley gets a bit more in depth with some of the character, other characters, mm. which is not a bad thing. Um, and yeah, I think she's sort of trying to rile them up with her psychiatrist. Yeah, you see a lot more of that kind of side. Of yeah, it, but. She's hot as well, so it doesn't hurt to have on the screen for everyone. <laughs> yes. Mm. Yep. Yeah. Um, then I got another summer blockbuster type that was a bit of a letdown for some people. Batman and Superman. Ultimate Edition. Ultimate Edition. Um, which has the which, best minutes extra. Yeah, it did add a few more things in, and they were, yes. to be honest, I think it did help. I mean, yeah. it, did, added, it, it helped flesh out a bit more all the Superman kind of thing, and mm. the sort of going from place to place and he's looking into you know, the battle yeah. and all that sort of stuff. Um, spoilers. <laughs> uh, but yeah, no, I, I like it and I've, I like Man of Steel and you know, I know Zack Snyder gets a bit of a hard time but I, I like some of his films. He's Henry Cavill is very good as Superman. I think. Yeah. He's, he's hot. 
Oh yeah, he's a dead, he's totally got <laughs> I mean, I'm not even going to lie, you know what I mean? <laughs> uh, and then I've got, this is The Killing Joke, an adaptation of a graphic novel comic book, well-known one of the Batman. Spectrum. Universe. <laughs> yeah, that, that <laughs> thing. Um, it's uh, Mark, Mark Hamill voices the Joker, in case anyone didn't know that. That's one of the things he's probably most famous for outside of Luke Skywalker. Mm. So, um, oh, a little bit different. Yeah, rate 15 as well, so, <laughs> yeah. Should be good. Uh, me with you. Okay. Um, okay, I've got a couple of these for Christmas. Um, I've got Far Cry Primal PS4. Which you've been really enjoying. Playing. I've been kind of really ploughing for it. Because yeah. you've been ill watching vlogs, I've just been downstairs playing with you, which I, I very rarely actually do anymore. Um, but yeah, Steph got me three and four. And um, yeah, for those who've got number four or PlayStation, I've got Platinum. So. <laughs> <laughs> this week I'm next Platinum Dragon. <laughs> Um, so yeah, really enjoying this, or Caveman era, uh, and then continuing with the, the epic saga of Nathan Drake, Uncharted 4, which only, I'm not playing at the moment. No. I played a, three or four chapters into it. <laughs> yeah. um, well, it's because you kind of play it because I like watching you it. You like the story, you like <laughs> the characters. And I so, really like Uncharted, I yeah. like the story behind it, and like every game it just seems to get a bit more... It's very cinematic. Movie, like, yeah, yeah cinematic. Like, it, it, I mean, just one thing I mean, that I really hope like. that they make it as a movie. Well, they are planning to. I don't think it'll be the same. You just but need to find the right Nathan. Yeah, I mean, just a li just little things like that. You play him in his house, sort of in the set on the sofa. Oh. And you're playing Crash Bandicoot. Which yeah, but is I so think bizarre. I think that's because this is the last one, so well, it's kind never. of like an ode. Yeah, never say never, though, you know, to the old games. Yeah. yeah. Um, <clears throat> you still? Yeah. Um, I'm an ex-smoker, which, yeah, um, so Steph got me a smoke alien kit, uh, which is a, a battery device and a tank, and then she got me the bigger boy version of it, because this comes with a smaller one, of the Cloud Beast, and when I say it's a Cloud Beast, the vapour is huge. You so, can give it a go if you want. So that's the little baby one, sure. and then that tank there on top, not not this, just this, that's the big version of it, so yeah. Um, He's very happy with it, keeps going on about how it's such a beast and... Well, well yeah, that, that one especially, I mean, something, so, something small so small yeah. pumps out so much vapour, it's ridiculous, right? <laughs> Can you give it a go? Yeah, I'll do it at about three quarters of the point. <laughs> I blew it that way, I didn't blow it that way. I know. Um, <laughs> it's been on the table the whole time. <coughs> taking pulls on it. Oh, it's smoking it. <coughs> oh. Don't worry. Whew. There you go. Yeah. So I do that when Steph's not in the room. Yes. And then my... Can you uh, literally fill the house up with smoke? Sometimes I come downstairs and I have to look at my glasses and think, my glass is <laughs> dirty. My it blow. looks smoggy. Yeah. <laughs> and my in-laws got me a... 120 ml bottle of like an apple juice, I guess you call it. Um, yeah. Yeah. So, which smells really, really good. Or, or pick up at the post office and in the envelope, I thought it had leaked because I could smell it through the box and the envelope. <laughs> and all that. It's kind of like um, like a really good apple juice, not the diluted kind, mm. but like the ex I don't know if you buy an expensive apple juice or something. Like a really <laughs> sweet apple juice. Yeah. I like it. Yeah, so when nice. I was smelling it, I was like, look at my lips. <laughs> yeah. So I've, yeah, so I've currently got that in here, yeah, which is very nice. And then you've got the oh, yes. Oh, my hair got caught in my glasses. So I also got another 12 month PlayStation Plus. Yeah, um, I printed these out because they were all e codes. So, yeah, code. <laughs> well, I didn't print them out. We don't have a printer, no, so I had to get my parents yeah. to do it. Yeah. Um, Code's been used already. So, yeah, so I mean, you can play online, but you, you need it to play online. So, yeah. I only play your Smite, don't you? So. I love Smite. Uh, there any anyone smite play Smite? Things? Yeah. You do it. <laughs> yeah. And then she just got me, I don't know if it's a print out, but it's basically a £20 uh, PSN credit, which I spent on Smite instantly. instantly like, just Gone like that. <laughs> he saw, I said to him, right, put the code in and see what it is. He's like, what is it? What is it? 
And then, yeah, as soon as he saw what it was, he was like... It's the equivalent of, like, you having unlimited funds and going into a shoe shop or something and just go to a handbag shop and buy. <clears throat> right, so, yes, carrying on with my presents. So these are all non-Disney ones, um, but you could say this is the Universal one. Ooh! Um, Secret Life of Pets. I saw this in the cinema uh, with my aunt, and again, we were just laughing non-stop. It's such a really good film. My favorite is Chloe and Gidget. Gidget because she's just like a fluffy white squeaky thing. Um, and Chloe because, well, everyone's got Chloe out of their, in their cat, haven't they? <laughs> She yeah. just doesn't give a crap. <laughs> barely speaking um, She's playing. But yeah, this is a re really good film. Really? Did it sort of quiet It's not quiet. You're loud when you do that. Okay. Anyway, really good film and I would definitely check it out if you haven't already. Um, I thought it was cute. Yeah, we, we've watched all of these movies because David hasn't seen any of them apart from Finding Dory we saw in the cinema. Which again, it's alright. Gerald's the best character. <laughs> yeah, we missed out on you the need a Gerald Gerald movie. Scenes. <laughs> Speaking of which, we have a, well, a finding Gerald. <laughs> Can yeah. you find him in this vlog? <laughs> yeah, and some of we kind of put it on our, our videos with Glee now. Yeah, I don't know, so we might make a sort of... habit of it with sit down ones or Yeah, ones it's all of the mascot. Yeah. Maybe you don't know if you can see it, but you probably can. <laughs> Um, so next up, I think I'll do this one because it's going to be difficult. Um, one of the uh, ladies at work, um, she, because I don't work for her, so she's, I mean, I guess she's kind of my colleague, but I don't work for her. She sort of rents off this space. But anyway, she's lovely, and I was not expecting a Christmas gift from her, but she got me a really nice uh, scarf which is really cute and it's um, tropical themed so it's got all tropical fishes on um, and yeah it's really cute so that'd be nice to wear sort of it was sweet. early summer it was very sweet when I do that yeah she's I love her though she's so sweet she's like she's, little granny she's the the wife of the husband who was there when Disney World was open Disneyland. Disneyland he went to the opening of Disneyland so, yeah. Epcot, and I think he went to the opening of Walt Disney World as well. Which so is he's got pretty awesome. a lot of stories, and like yeah. their daughter, um, she goes to Disney all the time as well. So yeah. <laughs> she, put, um, the mum, put her in touch with me yeah. on Facebook. She's like, oh, she loves talking Disney, so um, she'll love to talk to you. And yeah. <laughs> so I was like, fine. <laughs> um, so next up again, really spoiled. Um, is Pandora. Loving the boxes this year. Yeah, I'm surprised really they've done that. Um, yeah, although I don't know what it's done to... Right, you to the next one, but yes, I got... I don't know if you can see that very well. Try um, My ring. But it's the Forget Me Not ring. And it's absolutely beautiful. I. It's just so dainty and so pretty and it's, it doesn't fit the finger that I want it to fit on, which is really annoying, so we're gonna have to return it. This is the one that I normally wear it on. But, okay, there you go. Yeah, well, kind of. Um, but it's so pretty, it's got a nice purple stone in the middle, and then you've got diamante around um, the edges for the flower, and it's just so pretty, and I love it so much, and I kept, I kept staring at it all break, because I was like, Oh, <laughs> so yes, I really love that. That is, again, I was totally not expecting that. Um, and then, so the next one is another Pandora, and this one, I don't like the way that they've done it because it's ruined my box. Basically, they put it's a charm, so they've put it on this stick, and it's just rip, hmm. ripped everything <laughs> on there. So. <laughs> Hmm. But what I'll do is I'll see if I can do it this way. Maybe. But it is a Santa. A Santa charm. And um, yeah, it's really cute. It's the enamel type as well. So it's got Merry Christmas on one side. Oh, on both sides. And then Santa with presents. And his outfit is red enamel. And I like the enamel type ones because 
it gives it a bit mm. more <laughs> character. I can't remember. <laughs> right, we're almost done, I promise. Um, <clears throat> so, my next presents were the next instalments that I'm up to on Game of Thrones. Excuse my, my bear. <laughs> that is awesome. Yes, he is cool. He's a little tail. Um, which my cat keeps trying to steal. It's like, no, it's, my, it's mine. Go away. <laughs> but yeah, I am up to A Storm of Swords, um, Steel and Snow. And I kind of need to read the end of the last book because I can't remember what happened. It's book number three. Yeah. Yes. So that is going to keep me entertained and occupied. For a bad day. <laughs> yeah, I do read quite quickly, but I'm I'm loving the books. I mean, I I love the show. I can't wait for the next season to come out. And I thought, right, I'm going to start reading the books because originally I bought it for David to read, and he's just not reading them. So I started, and yeah, I've been loving reading them and stuff, and and reading all the bits that haven't made it into the show as well, which is yeah. pretty cool. I tried to read it. It was too much <coughs> fluff, you know, too much fluff. It was all get to the point, mate. Right? <laughs> And then my next mm. present. I should have now. Oh dear. My next present is the illustrated Harry Potter and Chamber of Secrets. Um, I have the first one, which David bought me for my birthday last year. Um, and I love these. I haven't read them yet, but I'm going to because you know. And it's the full book as well. Oh, here we go. This is diagonally. <coughs> Um, and it's just so cool. I mean, you know, like I've got the original children's version of the book, so it's more mm -hmm. kind of like this kind of illustration. Whereas I think um, there was the adult version as well, which was smaller writing. I think. I don't know. It's just so cool. I'm thinking about maybe doing an Instagram stories on this and just sort of flicking through. So if you want to check that out when I do do it, I'll link my Instagram view. Yeah. All 500 pages. <laughs> yeah, 500 pages. Read along with Steph. Yeah. <laughs> um, and then the very last present <clears throat> is seem, from my parents. It does seem very, very random. Though. It is random, but I keep saying, Oh yeah, we want to get one of these, and then we never get around to getting it, so I thought, well, my parents will get it for me, I know they will. <laughs> so, it's basically a... Oh, keep it in the mouth. <laughs> it's basically a deep fat fryer, um, and it's probably the most unhealthiest gift to get, because we are trying to lose some weight. Um, we need to try and lose weight this year. We want fried chicken. I want fried chicken. You're making me fried chicken. And donuts. And donuts. You've got to have fried chicken and donuts, basically. Ooh, and beignets. Your beignets, yeah. Yeah, beignets. yeah. And then, I don't know, we could try some fried green beans. Mm. Like from their Yeah. Party. We're not like, we don't <laughs> eat all five food, so I just no. <laughs> full disclosure. Well, one thing I won't be making in here is chips because I prefer them. Mm. So. Literally, you're purely for your own before. <laughs> you want, fried chicken. You want fried chicken. I don't want to keep paying for KFC, so what I we mean is just make our own. Well, we're actually going to make some today. Yeah. Um, so maybe I'll do a little. Uh, I made it before in the frying pan for a little yeah, saucepan. Yeah, it, it was actually really good. Mm. So, yeah. Um, but that is it for Christmas 2016. Um, it has been really good. I've had, apart from being sick, it's been a nice. Oh, hello. Whoa. It's been a nice break. Um, and I've enjoyed my time off with David. And we've watched so many films as well. And we tend, that's what we tend to do. We just because we're boring I, and we don't go out. So. It's not even that. I, I I slob around basically when it comes to Christmas. I don't want to go anywhere. I don't want to do anything at all. <laughs> I want to just be in my house and enjoy my presents and time with Steph and just you know eating and drinking and. But yes. Yeah, so thank you for watching along. Um, thank you. Let us know in the comments below what you got for Christmas. What was your favourite gift? Um, what was your favourite part of Christmas as well? You know, did you go out um, anywhere? Did you go see any films? Um, yeah, just leave a comment below. Yeah, it's please. always nice to hear from you guys. Yeah, we do like to see you know people commenting and. Yes. So, um, happy New Year again. Mm -hmm. um, and there's 
lots of hopefully exciting stuff coming up. We're trying to figure out um, what we want to do. I've got a few ideas of some days out that I want to share with you all. Um, and I don't know, maybe we might do some tags and some some reviews. Mm. Yeah, we got like, we want to be taking a few things as well. Sort yeah. Of yeah. So I mean, if you guys can think of any videos that you'd like to see us do, let us know as well. Um, and yes, we shall see you next time. Mm. <laughs> Bye. Happy New Year. Happy New Year. Bye. Bye. <laughs>